In response to fans' fears that the TLC series will be canceled, Tammy Slayton's future on 1000 Ellaby Sisters has been confirmed. Tammy's and her sister Amy's thoughts on filming additional seasons are exclusively available to The Sun. According to an exclusive source who spoke to The Sun, Tammy has huge ambitions following her stay in Ohio rehab. The 1000 Ellaby Sisters star has been considering the future while the cameras have been rolling behind the scenes of her recovery. According to Tammy's friend, Tammy intends to look for a book deal. She wishes to spread awareness of body positivity and share her entire journey. However, as she gets ready to welcome her second kid, her sister Amy isn't as excited about the prospect of a book. Amy is open to the possibility of entering season four, but she hasn't been completely persuaded. Amy previously told The Sun that she felt like a bad mom to her son Gage, one, and that she intended to leave the show if the producers didn't reduce her hours. Even if Emmy did decide to leave the show, Tammy's pal wasn't concerned about her future. Tammy's friend believed Tammy could be able to go alone and liken the celebrity to the Honey Boo Boo franchise. There are so many options for Tammy even if Emmy did quit the show, they stated, expressing their full support for the star's candid book deal. Tammy wants to finish her stay sooner than doctors initially predicted, and The Sun exclusively provided significant updates on her progress in her Ohio treatment facility. After her Instagram account was hacked, Tammy created a hidden account that only family and friends could follow, according to an exclusive interview with her pal that was published in The Sun. After disappearing from her public social media earlier this year, the celebrity sent a selfie on April 27 from within rehab onto her private Instagram account. In another picture, Tammy drank a calorie-free Coke Zero while displaying a painting. With her hair pulled back and her black tank top on, she displayed her painting with pride. Months after being spotted partying hard on her reality program, Tammy's friend claimed that she had completely stopped drinking and smoking. Tammy doesn't even want to be around it, her companion insisted, despite the fact that patients are permitted to smoke outside the treatment facility. Tammy hasn't had a drink since she left for treatment, according to The Insider. Doctors were worried about Tammy's life when she said she drank eight bottles of alcohol every week on the previous season of the show. In clips from the show, she also openly vaped, ate pizza, and requested shots of whiskey from friends. She even briefly stopped breathing following a party bender in the season finale. According to the source, Tammy's progress has allowed her to have surgery that has resulted in a smaller breathing tube. To make breathing easier, the tracheotomy surgery makes a surgical incision from the neck to the windpipe. Even though her trash has shrunk, she still despises it, the source told The Sun. Now, Tammy is only required to wear it occasionally. She is doing incredibly well and will leave rehab earlier than expected. She was initially scheduled to leave in late August, but she will leave earlier. Her birthday is coming up in July, and she would love to be able to celebrate at home. Tammy wants to do everything she can to be there when her sister Amy gives birth to her second baby this summer, the insider also revealed. According to Tammy's acquaintance, she's exceeded all expectations. According to a previous article in The Sun, Amy was on the verge of leaving due to pressure from the producers and her new role as a mother. As she balances her TV work with taking care of their toddler, Gage, the 34-year-old actor, who is expecting her second child with husband Michael Halterman, says she gets anxious when filming. Amy told The Sun at the time that she was waiting for the network to contact her so that negotiations could begin, as she was not under contract for season four of the well-liked TLC reality show. I've been on the show for three years, she stated, speaking from her new residence in Morganfield, Kentucky. It was simple at first, but now that I have Gage, it seems like he wants to keep me in his line of sight. When I'm at work, I feel like I'm acting like a bad mother. When we're filming and doing other things, he's always at his grandmother's. I feel as though I'm wasting time. Amy went on, it's just a lot, and I don't really want to do another season because I'm pregnant. I should be all right if they reduce my hours. However, I worked every day for weeks during the previous season in addition to remodeling a house, taking care of Gage, Tammy, and my mother. Last year was just too much, and I'm not able to handle it.
As the spotlight on Tammy Slayton continues to shine, her journey on 1,000 Elves Sisters has captivated viewers worldwide. With her roller coaster of weight loss triumphs, health scares, and emotional breakthroughs, Tammy's transformation has been the cornerstone of the show. But as rumors circulate about the future of 1,000 Elves Sisters, fans are left in suspense, wondering if the beloved TLC series might be coming to an end. Is Tammy Slayton's story winding down? Or is there still more to unfold? The TLC reality series 1000 Old Sisters premiered in 2020. Following the lives of Tammy and Amy Slayton, two sisters from Kentucky struggling with obesity. Their bond, often marked by humor, sibling bickering, and heartfelt moments, resonated with viewers. The show quickly gained a loyal fan base, drawn to its authenticity and the Slayton sisters' relatable battles with food addiction, family dynamics, and body image. At the heart of the series was Tammy's uphill battle to regain her health. Weighing over 600 pounds at her heaviest, she faced life-threatening health issues, including sleep apnea, mobility challenges, and the constant fear of heart failure. The stakes were high, and fans were invested in her quest to qualify for bariatric surgery, a life-changing procedure that could reverse her declining health. Throughout the seasons, Tammy's progress was anything but linear. Her weight loss journey saw moments of hope, but also setbacks. In the early seasons, she struggled to commit fully to the program, and her frustrations often played out on screen. At one point, Tammy even checked into a food addiction rehabilitation center, but fans witnessed her gaining more weight after leaving. The show's emotional intensity peaked when Tammy suffered a near-fatal health crisis. After experiencing difficulty breathing, she was rushed to the hospital and placed on life support. The reality of Tammy's situation hit viewers hard. For many, it was a wake-up call, not only for Tammy, but also for how obesity impacts millions of lives across the world. But despite these close calls, season five saw a dramatic turnaround for Tammy. She committed fully to her weight loss journey, losing over 300 pounds, and finally qualifying for the bariatric surgery she had been working toward for years. Fans were overjoyed by her transformation, not just in terms of physical weight loss, but also in the emotional and mental growth she displayed. Tammy became a symbol of perseverance, and her story inspired countless others struggling with their own health battles. As 1,000 of sisters continued to follow Tammy's transformation, season six brought new developments. Fans were eager to see Tammy's next steps after her massive weight loss. Would she undergo skin removal surgery? The excess skin left after such significant weight loss can be physically uncomfortable and emotionally challenging. For Tammy, this surgery would be another milestone in her journey, symbolizing not only the removal of her past struggles, but also her rebirth into a healthier, more confident version of herself. TLC's cameras documented her consultations with surgeons, her preparations for the procedure, and the anxieties she felt leading up to the surgery. Tammy's vulnerability and honesty about her fears resonated with fans once again. The anticipation for this next chapter in her life grew, and many viewers were excited to see how the surgery would further impact her life. However, as season six progressed, rumors began swirling among fans about the future of 1,000 Elves Sisters. Many started to speculate that TLC might be planning to cancel the series. This speculation was fueled by a few factors. First. Amy Slatton, Tammy's sister and co-star, had shifted focus after the birth of her second child. While Amy's role in the series had always been integral, her priorities now seemed to be centered around motherhood rather than her own weight loss journey. Moreover, with Tammy achieving such significant milestones, some fans wondered if there was enough story left to tell. Would her life post-surgery be as compelling to watch? Could the show maintain its emotional intensity without the same level of drama that earlier seasons delivered? As the series had always thrived on the Slayton sisters' ups and downs, there was concern that Tammy's newfound stability might signal the end of the road for the show. Adding to the uncertainty, Tammy herself has expressed mixed feelings about continuing with reality TV. In interviews and on social media, she has hinted that life in the spotlight comes with its own set of challenges. The constant scrutiny, online trolls, and the pressure to maintain her weight loss journey in front of millions have taken their toll. At times, 
Tammy has alluded to the possibility of stepping back from the cameras to focus on her personal growth away from the public eye. Despite these concerns, it's important to remember that Tammy's story is far from over. Even if 1,000 Ove sisters were to end, Tammy has other avenues to explore. Her popularity on social media platforms like TikTok and Instagram has only grown, and she could easily pivot to creating her own content, giving fans behind the scenes glimpses of her life post-show. In addition to social media, there could be opportunities for Tammy to share her story on other platforms. Many reality TV stars have transitioned into motivational speaking, writing books, or even starting their own health and wellness brands. Tammy's journey from life-threatening obesity to a healthier, more empowered version of herself could serve as an inspiration to many, and she could leverage her platform to continue spreading her message of perseverance and self-love. Furthermore, Tammy's relationships, both romantic and familial, still hold the potential for compelling storytelling. Whether it's her journey toward finding love, navigating friendships, or continuing to rebuild her relationship with her family, there are plenty of emotional narratives left to explore, even if 1,000 of sisters doesn't return. While there are valid concerns about the show's future, many fans have taken to social media to voice their desire for 1,000 of sisters to continue. They argue that Tammy's story is still evolving, and there's more to learn from her experiences as she adjusts to her new body and lifestyle. Fans also miss the dynamic between Tammy and Amy whose sibling relationship remains a central part of the show's charm. Some have even speculated that TLC could choose to reformat the show, focusing more on Tammy's life post-surgery or exploring new challenges that come with maintaining such a significant weight loss. After all, losing the weight is only the beginning. Keeping it off and adapting to a new reality presents its own set of struggles. Whether or not 1,000 of Sisters continues on TLC, Tammy Slayton's story is far from finished. While fans may fear the end of the series, Tammy has become a symbol of strength and resilience. Whether through TV, social media, or other ventures, she will undoubtedly continue to inspire others with her journey. As the uncertainty around the show's future looms, one thing is clear. Tammy Slayton has come too far to fade from the public eye.